Hi all, this is Master Muncher and welcome to another Naval 1v1 from Empire Total War playing with Darth Maul. And in this matchup we're fighting as the newly formed United States of America. That you got that right, still with the circular uh, stars in the flag, the beginning of the superpower that we know today. And we are, what is more fitting than give and test the most modern machinery that this mod offers in a naval unit the steamship named Hector so let's go with that 34 guns 129 sailors but the major thing about this incredible ship is the engine that is right on the center now it allows us to move quickly and turn really well without having to worry about wind which is the main advantage we have 34 guns and 129 marines and sailors so this is a very good um, naval unit however because of the of the um, of the engine right in the middle we are successful to blowing up by strong broadsides from our enemies this is the what you need to take into account but, but nevertheless <clears throat> sorry the United States of America did try to modernize and increase their Navy and their naval presence around the world and the Atlantic as fast as they could, as innov innovative as they were able. And this is just a prelude to their industrial power, even though the British started that, they still were incredibly powerful. And today we are ha fighting the Mexican Empire, Mexico. And we are fighting against the Razi, which I believe is a frigate and is essentially a ship of the line, but cut one of the levels so it makes it more maneuverable but still have a lot of firepower and durability 40 oh we already lost a cannon we probably we already fired so 48 guns but 47 now 177 soldiers 176 now but uh yeah it's a very strong ship uh, and uh, the name was really cool so i wanted to test it out so if you guys know anything about raziz or if how if i'm pronouncing it wrong please let me know they're incredibly cool and you not unique to them but unique vessel and yeah the matchup today is essentially a f uh, a battle between powers around the gulf of mexico the 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 americans uh, just build the ship and they wanted to test it out against pirates but then they were at war with the mexico empire and they found this razi and they decided to see how strong this steamship really can be so without further ado let's see who wins modernity or tradition in this battle oh and uh, they're trying to get a broadside before to destroy our guns or our engines we not allow that to happen. That's alright, actually. Oh my god, they broke our... Whoa! What? This is... What the hell just happened? Sorry, I'm flabbergasted. All right, so I was going to say, even if they destroy our masts with this specific ship, that actually doesn't matter because we have this team ship. But, man, the Razi didn't have any... The, Raz the Razi didn't have any engines and they blew up. Oh my god, that was disgusting. Another big boom and I wasn't, I wasn't ready for it. I was not ready for it, but still cool. Nonetheless, Jesus. So this is the team steamship that powerful? All right. Um, so <laughs> in this quicker than I thought matchup, with only one broadside in each one, uh, the the American steamship proved the admirably um, admirably really right that they are incredibly powerful. Even losing a mast to the Razi first broadside, which was incredibly effective, then they released their broadside and blew the ship up. So yeah. New new statistics, lost five, you know, Hector destroy this ship. So there you go, guys. Very surprising, very quick. Trust me, I'm surprised that you are. So thank you very much for watching this Naval 1v1. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed and see you all <laughs> next time.